hey you sexy motherfucker. So I'm probably just gonna take this Snapchat rant and just put it on YouTube because I'm two hours away and I don't have anything to film. I look like poo, so <laughs> that's what I'm probably gonna do. So I apologize. And I needed to use a filter because I have very minimal makeup on and I have a blemish on my face, so that, yeah. <laughs> I need my makeup for these. I needed to rant right now because I saw something and I'm very, very much alarmed. So yeah, I'm two hours away. I'm sitting in the waiting room at my my doctors waiting <laughs> so I'm checking my socials <laughs> I get on Instagram first right first thing I see is this lovely photo <laughs> from Joe's exotic mall. oh my god genius I f love her anyways but then I get on Twitter and the very first thing I see is this clip and I am alarmed for supporting my mom my mother and I's relationship because none of the rest of the family uh, even remotely comes close to speaking to my mom unless they use her um, to try to get me like they tried to use my mom last year to get me 5150 my mom told all my siblings to go fuck themselves and that's why that didn't happen <coughs> <coughs> because I'm actually not crazy you can drive by my houses all you want you can take you can try to invoke paranoia like all you want but I I am going to wake up this morning, I'm going to let you know that in tw 12 corners of my house, you've only seen two, no, two of my guns. All right. In 12 corners of my house, I have guns in every place in my house, legally, with a license. Okay? So, don't ever, ever try to do anything stupid here because I will kill you. Okay, I will kill you. I will shoot you where you stand, just like my daddy shot motherfuckers where they stood. And he said, well, I will kill you. Yeah. What? For one, how did the siblings use Jane? All of the siblings, Nick, Angel, and even BJ, they've all said that Jane uses them. Even Aaron said that before. Jane uses them for money, a place to stay, etc., etc. Nick, especially. What does she have that Nick is using her for? Aaron's logic is they're using Jane to get to Aaron to 5150 him. Bitch, I'm pretty sure you don't need Jane for that. You can just do that on your own. Duh. Oh my god. Blah, 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 blah. That makes no sense. And then, and then, this genius says, I'm not crazy, and then proceeds to grab his guns and say he would kill a motherfucker. And he has guns all over his house. Did I mention that he said he would kill anyone? And then... <laughs> Okay, good way to criminalize your father that has passed away, saying that he shot people and whatever. Your parents already have a bad rep. You're making it worse. Your dad's not around anymore. He passed away. Why does he disrespect his f family that have been in general, but his family that's passed? Are you sh me? What is wrong with him? I mean, and then, like, dude, you're making yourself look ridiculous. You're making yourself look crazy. I'm not crazy, but I'll shoot a motherfucker if there's guns all over my house. Right there. Someone in authority see that? They're gonna assume, oh, okay, this guy is not stable. He shouldn't have his guns. Like, you're talking shit. Right after you get your guns back because they were gone because of a restraining order for a year you didn't have them and then he's like oh they're all legal how are they legal you have a medical marijuana card you can't possess a gun if you have a medical marijuana card boom right there that's in most states even in pa where i live if y'all know pa we're, we're a bunch of rednecks depending on where you're at no i'm just kidding i'm not a redneck but you live in california California. I don't understand how this guy is free. How does he have guns? How does he sell a medical marijuana card because he has guns? How does he have guns because he's crazy? Put the medical marijuana card aside. He's just nuts. Dude, you do realize people are going to use your lives again against you. You're making yourself look horrible. If Nick, Lauren, and I heard that he's threatening Lauren again, who's pregnant again, I guess. I could be wrong. I haven't looked into it. I'll let y'all know if I'm wrong right here. <laughs> but that's just what I heard. So Nick, Lauren, Angel, 
and I guess BJ, I thought that they were cool. I, I thought that he was gonna help his sister get an OnlyFans, that's gross. Any of y'all get another restraining order cause right there, he's saying he would kill them. I also just realized something. How come Aaron only shows that one gun? It's always the same one. Oh, I have guns everywhere in every corner of my house. Oh, do ya? Do you really? Why is it that we only see the one? You're dumb. I don't believe that he has all these guns. He says, oh, I have like 200. Prove it, but you won't. Oh, so you have all these guns. You have like 200 guns, but that one particular gun is the only one that's always right there. And yet another bullshit lie. Try to sound tough. What a tough guy. I'm so scared. <sighs> sure, Jan. And He's saying he's a part of the mafia, bitch. What? <laughs> and then dropping names of this supposed dude in the mafia that he's tight with. Pretty sure if that was real and you actually did know someone in the mafia and you did give an accurate name, you wouldn't be around. You'd have a target on your back, you dumb sh**. But no, you don't know anyone in the mafia. Gangs, mafia, you're Aaron Carter. Candy. You ain't tough. You're not scared. You are scary. <sighs> like, for the obvious reasons. How can you claim he's sober? Please, please explain to me. I had someone recently say that I was on crack. Someone that said they were going to expose me for whatever, whatever. I have a video coming out soon. The truth about like my addiction, how I got in recovery, and I go in details about everything. So I expose myself. That's what happens when you're very, very honest. But anywho, he's not in his right mind. He's not. And please, bitch, wash your hands. Your hands are so dirty. Your fingernails are dirty. That's disgusting. Do I really have to make another clip how to wash your hands? Because you should probably do that. Showering, hygiene. It's a good thing. It's, it's good. It's good. Oh my God. LMG, please. Once again, how can you stand by this guy? He's spiraling. You can tell he's got his DOC because he's being extra crazy again. This is just not going to end well for him. I always say, if you were true fans, you would not enable this behavior. You would not cheer him on. You would not say that this is okay because it's not okay. Fuck. Could you imagine if I was doing that? If I waved my gun around in the air, high as sh said I was gonna kill people. You people, oh my God. Like I get criticized because I'm honest about my recovery. I get this and that and this and that because we talk about Aaron. But if I did that, oh my God. I would probably would get arrested. Even though my gun is actually legal. Actually, it's my husband, so. It's in his name, so it's legal for him. I would be crazy bitch but these lmgs are cheering aaron on and calling him a badass and totally throwing gasoline on the fire it's not gonna end well i hope y'all know that jesus listen i don't know why mama jane thinks that this is okay if she's watching any of this seeing her son do this because if i was acting that way my parents would have a f okay it doesn't matter if i'm a grown adult my mom and dad would put me in and so would my stepdad, so would my brother, so would my sister-in-laws, so would my husband. And the fact no one's doing anything and you, he's got like 15 little minions, LMGs, cheering him on. So insane and so bizarre. And Melanie is backing him and his mom's backing him. What the f*** is wrong with y'all? Ah! Please get help. It's really scary again. It's always been scary, but it's getting scarier. Why don't these people do anything? Like, Melanie, check your man. How about that? Give him a blowy and make him calm down. <laughs> but if you are going to give him a blowy, please keep that sh private and in your bedroom. Don't put that on OnlyFans because your OnlyFans is cringy as sh Boring as fuck. Not in my words. I'm not into porn, but ain't nobody want to see that. Why is it okay that Aaron... I don't understand, but I just had to hop on Snappy for a second. And Snappy. Spill some tea. <laughs> Mind blown right now. These people are crazy but I, I need to be exposed okay 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 something needs to be done i think he's a big puss and he wouldn't do anything but the way he's so paranoid and the way he's waving his guns around like that someone's gonna get hurt 
if it's not himself he's not safe melanie's not safe those dogs aren't safe yeah you know what i am just gonna put this on youtube so this is gonna be my shortest video ever i really needed to talk about this and show this clip because people need to be aware that this guy is off his rocker and the lmg so are they insanity get help please obviously this isn't my real update i i will have an update coming i'll probably start writing it today to film more videos are coming i have a funny skit parody type Aaron videos is coming and then I have my addiction story coming and then a few other videos but I, I will have a real update I just need to talk about this there's some people that have been asking me to do live streams on YouTube not in replace of my Aaron updates but like videos like this to talk about or live reactions or to just hang out and for y'all to ask me questions and whatever I'm thinking about it I think it's a really good idea. It'd be fun, you know, to like interact with y'all. But <laughs> if you think about it, how many people would actually watch in real time? You know what I mean? I mean, I feel like only like 10 people would actually watch one of my live streams. <laughs> but I am like so shy. Even if there was only two people watching, I would be like, I'm so shy. This is so different. No one's watching me as I'm filming this right now. I feel like I'd just be so awkward. And the biggest thing with this is I can edit out all the ums and hmms and buzz. <laughs> the blank awkward stares when I'm trying to think of what was I gonna say? You know? <laughs> Can't do that on a live stream. All the ums, all the awkward silences will be there. I don't know. I think like the first, cause I do want to do live streams. I think it'd be something new, but I think for my very first one, would rather do it with someone else. Like do a collab type live stream or like connect with one of y'all on live stream, you know, and do it that way. Just so I'd be more comfortable. Cause I've never even done like an Instagram live, you know, this whole new ball field or whatever that thing is for me it's like a whole new world i always said i'd rather a few more followers like a couple more thousand or something i don't know but it doesn't matter i will think about it i'm not saying it's gonna be like tomorrow it'll happen i will let y'all know on my social medias but these kind of videos the long updates and like these short random videos are just gonna have to do for right now that's all i had to say but I gotta go. I have a two hour drive ahead of me and I gotta call my dad. Let me know your opinions on that clip and the mafia thing and whatever. Like I said, I'm gonna have an actual update, but. Mini mukbang. Mm, so good. I decided at the end of my videos now, I'm gonna start doing a current obsession and a song that I think y'all should check out. Cause I get really obsessed over things and my favorite song changes a lot too current obsession is where i got this idea from snooki from the jersey shore her podcast with her best friend joey because it's funny as <laughs> you won't listen to it on spotify i love it actually i have two more obsessions amazon because i've literally spent like three grand on amazon the last like month i have such a bad issue with it my mailman hates me also cherry jolly ranchers i think that's why i broke back back tooth back here but they're so good. I literally will buy an entire bag of Jolly Ranchers and pick out the cherries and throw the rest away. <laughs> Chris is like, it's a waste. It's just candy. Yeah, like I said, I have a lot of obsessions and I just don't give a I can't help it. I have a very addictive personality, so. Let me tell you, a weekly obsession is not this breakfast sandwich because they only put one piece of bacon on it. That's bullshit. There it went. My favorite song right now that I think y'all should check out is On God by Johnny Craig or literally anything by Slaves with Johnny Craig in it. Just check out Beautiful Death by Slaves. That entire album is fuck beautiful. He has a voice of an angel. He's a piece of person. He's got really bad heroin addiction and he's done horrible stuff, but he has a voice of an angel. Oh my God. I'm gonna do this every video except for my addiction video because that's serious. I yeah, I'm not gonna do that. This McDonald's sucks by the way. They were not friendly either, so. Oh, cool, oh, cool. See y'all on the flip side. Bye-bye.